What is going on, guys? <coughs> what is going? <coughs> so apparently in Las Vegas, whenever you have the dry heat and you're not used to it, it'll give you a really sore throat, and that's that's exactly why I have one right now. But anyways, what is going on, guys? Ducks and Samar in here. Hope you guys are having a great day. And I just want to say that Black Ops 3 is so much fun to play. Now, if you guys follow me on my Instagram accounts, I've been doing a lot of crazy stuff recently. I've been going shooting guns. I've been going, you know, in helicopter tours to the Grand Canyon. I've just been doing a lot of crazy, crazy stuff. And honestly, that's cool and stuff. Don't get me wrong. I really enjoy, like, everything that's going on right now. But I've just been really wanting to play Black Ops 3. My inner nerd is starting to show. I just want to play Black Ops 3 every single day. And I know this is the last day of the beta, so I figured I should get a video out before the beta actually actually ends before I actually go away again to Mexico. That's right guys, if you guys didn't know, I'm going to be in Mexico for two weeks with my girlfriend. So a lot of my videos for the next two weeks, and then after that I'm going to be going away to Orlando for eight days. So for almost the next month of my life, I'm going to be having a lot of vlogs on my channel. I'm getting a lot of comments on things I do, like, Doug, you're living the craziest life, you have the best girlfriend in the world, you're going skydiving, you just went to Vegas for your birthday, like you're living the life. And honestly, I just want to have a lot of fun. I just want to be able to enjoy myself. It's been a long time since I've seen my girlfriend, so I'm really excited to be back in Mexico. I'm actually going to be staying in her apartment with her. So that's really exciting and I just want to get back there I just want to hang out with her I just want to have some fun and we're also gonna be going to Cancun in Mexico we're gonna be going to a wedding in Mexico so there's a lot of crazy stuff going on I'm sure I'm gonna get a lot of good vlog footage as well right now everything is great things are perfect I have great friends I have great family I have a great girlfriend my YouTube channel is doing well my family is okay I'm traveling a lot I'm seeing things but something doesn't feel right eh, I'm just I'm just gonna leave that game I'm, I'm done so in the past day I've went skydiving I've gambled in Vegas I've drank in Vegas I shot guns and I also went on a great Grand Canyon helicopter tour. And honestly, the best thing about turning 21, believe it or not, is the fact that I actually have an ID that says that I'm 21 years old. I don't want you guys to take that as me being spoiled. I don't want you guys to- I just got destroyed, dude. I don't want you guys to take that as me being unappreciated for everything because I'm super appreciated that the fact that I was able to go to Vegas with my dad, that's what I've always wanted to do, and I was able to do all those crazy things. But money can't buy you happiness, people. I know a lot of you guys think that money is everything in the world, and it's really not. To me, being 21 signifies that I am a legal adult, and I'm going to be respected in society as an adult. That, to me, is the most gratifying thing about being 21 years old. So right now, after I'm done making this cut com, I could go straight to 7-Eleven and buy a six-pack of Corona, and I'll be completely okay. I'm not going to be crucified for it. I do have a baby face, so they would ask me for my ID, and I would say that's not a problem, and I'll be good to go. And I'm not saying I'm going to go out every single day and drink, because I'm not. But just the fact that I'm able to do that, and I'm free to do that, is really cool to me. I'm not the biggest fan when it comes to drinking alcohol, and I'd be lying to you... Sick. I'm not the biggest fan of drinking alcohol, but I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I have drank alcohol before I was 21, and I don't drink that much. I know a lot of people when they're under 21, they think it's cool to drink, and then when they turn 21, it's not as cool to them. But for me, it's the complete opposite. Since I am 21 years old, I feel that it's cooler for me to drink now because I'm actually able and legal to go out and do it. The other day, I actually met fans in Las Vegas. I did a fan meetup for the first time, and my dad was recording for me as we were meeting the fans, and he did the worst job as a cameraman. Now, to be fair, my dad doesn't know anything about cameras, and he's just new to social media and Instagram and all that good stuff, but the camera angles were so bad, and I tried to do the best I could with what I had to make the video. I think the video could have came out much better, but it was my dad's first time ever recording with the camera, so I'll cut him some slack, but the fan meetup was so cool. I was so happy with how it turned out. You guys have no idea. Once I announced I was doing a fan meetup, I was so afraid that nobody would show up like what if only one person or no one at all would show up to the meetup and i was like what if that did happen it would be so embarrassing believe it or not over a hundred people showed up to the fan meetup it was ridiculous so many people were there so many parents were there all of you guys were supportive i sat there for about an hour and a half just signing things talking to everybody one of the guys actually started tearing up one of the last guys there he was crying and he said i was his biggest inspiration it was one of the best moments he looked at me straight in the eye and he started having tears of joy he wouldn't say a word to me and he just said i was his biggest inspiration i gave him this giant hug it was just such a heartwarming moment knowing that i always make these videos online for you guys to watch and i was able to see you guys in person and talk to you guys face to face just seeing all of the comments from online translating to person having all of you guys coming out to support this fan meetup was honestly the best thing it made my weekend it was better than gambling it was better than going to the grand canyon it was better than you know drinking and shooting guns like i said guys i wish that that video could have came out a little bit better but it's okay just having you guys come out to that meetup was really cool and i'll definitely be doing one of those again but like i said guys i just want to let you know that this will probably be one of the last cold duty videos on my channel for at least three more weeks if not maybe even a month i know you guys all love watching my vlogs with Ines, so i'm gonna be with her for two weeks making vlogs every single day if you guys have any suggestions or any video ideas at all for me to do with her just let me know in the comments down below and then right when i come back from mexico i'm going straight to orlando florida for eight days for something
that I don't think I can talk about quite yet. So I'm gonna be doing a lot of traveling, a lot of exciting things, and I hope that the vlogs can translate to how much fun that I'm probably gonna be having, and I hope you guys are gonna be enjoying them as well. That's gonna be it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. This is gonna be my last Black Ops 3 video on my channel until the game comes out. I cannot wait for that game to come out, guys, by the way. Like, it is so addicting. I can play this game all day long. But yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, drop a like on the video. This is video boy, Doug Sensor Martin, and I'm out, guys. Peace!